Hey what's up guys welcome back to another video. I'm going to tell you 5 ways you can save your battery on Samsung Galaxy S23 Ultra. So let's get right into that. Jumping on the first one, turning on dark mode is surely a way to decrease the battery consumption due to your screen being on. And if you have got an AMOLED display which most Samsung phones do, then this is definitely helpful. Dark mode on AMOLED screen imply that dark areas are indeed pixels that are turned off and hence they require less current and thereby reducing the battery consumption. In fact, if you use AMOLED wallpapers, it would help a bit more. Next thing you should do is go on and turn off the quick share and set it to no one. Samsung phones are always looking for another phones around to share files with and that eats up the battery. Whenever you want to receive files, just go ahead and turn it on for that moment and then turn it back off. Next, if you have got a lot of apps on your phone and you don't use every single one of them every day, chances are that they'll still be running in the background eating up some battery. One way is to completely uninstall them and another way is to put them to deep sleep. And that's the way they never run in the background. So go into your battery settings, then into background usage limits. Go into deep sleeping apps and then tap on the plus icon and then select apps that you don't use every day. Apps that you don't need notification from or you have no dependency on unless you want to open them up. And even while I'm doing this mindlessly without really focusing much on, I have been able to identify a few apps that are still not deep sleeping and I really don't need them eating up my battery in the background. Imagine how much battery you could save with this technique. Moving forward, you know guys, I have set up my Samsung phone in a way that if I am at home, then my location, mobile data and Bluetooth will remain off and it saves me some more battery. It's an automation that I have created using Bixby routine, which you can find in your app drawer. Open it and then say, if my Wi-Fi network is connected, select your home Wi-Fi network, tap on done and under the then condition, select connections and then go into mobile data and then turn that off. Then you also want to add another condition which your location should be turned off as well and go back into your connection and then select Bluetooth. And then you want to set that to off as well and there you have it. It's a simple rule that if your phone connected to your Wi-Fi network then all of these things should turn off and then just give this routine a name so that you can identify it later. Give it a color if you want to and an icon that you use. If you do use a lot of location apps and you still want to use this routine, I have a hack for that. So go back to Bixby routine, go to if and then tap on app open. Now select the apps that you think should trigger location to turn on. For example, banking apps or delivery apps or taxi apps. Once you have selected, then click on done and then under the done condition, go into your location and just set that to turn itself on. By the way, as soon as you exist these apps, location will automatically turn off. Just give it a name, give it a color and an icon and that's pretty much it. Now let's say my battery is already quite low, 20, 25 or 15% and I want the discharge of my battery to be slowed down and if I have a high refresh rate screen like 120Hz, it would be wise that my phone automatically shifted to 60Hz. So here's the last automation, under if condition go into battery level and tap on below 25. Okay, when that happens, go in the then condition and search for the motion smoothness and set that to 60 hertz. So your phone will automatically shift it to 60 hertz from 120 hertz if the battery level falls below 25. So guys, these are some of the settings you should tweak in order to save more battery life on your Samsung Galaxy S23 Ultra. So that's pretty much it guys. I hope this video has helped you out in some way. If you like this video, hit the like button and subscribe to the channel because it will help me to grow my channel more. Thanks for watching. Be sure to subscribe. Peace.